Hey, great day, y'all. Real quick, ask yourself this question. You don't got to ask it out loud. You don't got to answer it out loud. But ask yourself this question. Am I being led by my ego or my God state, my divinity, my the highest version of me, my source, the part of me that operates from a place of nothing missing and nothing broken, my peace? Do Am I influenced? Is my decision-making influenced? By those things, by that earth. thing, or Great is it influenced by my lesson. ego? I am peace, I am love. Our egos. I like how uh, I heard a gentleman say, ego stands for edging God out. And it is, because it's always an, an idea of you. Your ego is a self-made idea of a version of you that is separate from the source within you. The abundant power that is within you. It's the version of you that you create, that you imagine, the illusion of you that you create that is without connection to the almighty power and source within you. That's why everything that your ego be talking about is rooted in lack. That's why your ego needs so much protection. Because your ego is not connected to source not connected to abundance so it moves in a way of having to figure out what would allow it to survive source and abundance is on thriving mode not surviving mode if you missed my live the other day or yesterday rather i was talking about the difference between surviving and thriving in hopes that you would come to understand that there's different ways that you have been thinking operating and vibrating that are in our alignment with surviving and will never lead you to thriving. You hear what I'm saying?